All right, gang, how you all doing? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a fresh video. I am now back from my holiday. I've actually been back quite a while. I've just not had much to report on, but today we do have something to report on. We've got some first look images of a set that's due for release in October. So let's jump in and take a look. And the set in question, gang, is that of a brand new LEGO Ideas set. It's going to go by set number 21352 and will be known as the Disney Magic Set. It's a celebration of all things Disney, apparently. Don't know how with the limited Disney minifigs, but that's essentially the brief for this one. Uh, the piece count is going to be that of 1,103, and this will be priced around about the $100 mark. So probably looking at around 85 to 90 pounds here in the UK. Um, it comes with a bunch of minifigs. There's Lilo, Simba, Geppetto, Belle, Sebastian and Flounder, and there is another one in the pictures that hasn't been mentioned in this little um, brief that I've been given, and it's Bruno from Encanto, and obviously the reason he's been missed off is because we don't talk about Bruno, but I do like that, I think it's a nice little nod. Um, you can purchase this set from the 1st of October 2024, and I think if we're looking at the images, this is very, very cool, but considering this is supposed to be a celebration of all things Disney, there's a lot missing, don't we think? I think this is more a celebration of stuff that's come out more recent. Obviously, if you think about Encanto, that's a pretty recent movie. Uh, there's been a brand new Little Mermaid. There's been a live action version of uh, The Lion King, um, Pinocchio and uh, Beauty and the Beast. And obviously next year we're getting a live uh, action version of Lilo and Stitch. So I kind of think that's maybe the reason they've gone the way they have. I do like the Mickey Mouse though. I think that looks really, really cool. I always get it wrong if they're mops or if they're broomsticks, but essentially, obviously, the, they're, they're from the Fantasia movie, and Mickey is obviously dressed in the, the Fantasia dress as well. Um, but I like this. I actually think this is a pretty cool-looking thing, and I think this is going to be one of those that's a bit of a winner with a lot of people, especially those collecting the Disney stuff. My daughter, at four years old, see the pictures earlier of this and was like, Dad, that's super, super cool. I really like the look of that. Obviously, she's a bit young for this sort of set, but you know, it, it is gonna tick all the boxes. The only thing I will say is that Simba's face is a little derpy. That looks more like a um, a Duplo figure than it does a proper sort of minifig. But other than that, I think this is a pretty cool looking set. I really do. I, I quite like it. Probably some repeats where minifigs are concerned. I would imagine, you know, we've, we've probably had a bell before like this and that's been used again but outside of that i think this is amazing and uh this is gonna please a lot of fans um we're gonna get some printed eyepieces there by the looks of things i don't know if that's gonna be a sticker for the rose that could be a printed piece um you know how much i dislike stickers so the more printed pieces we get the better i'm hoping that the hat are prints and not stickers because i i just think that that would work better um you know lego I don't know how, but they, they they save a lot of money by producing stickers than they do the printed pieces. I'm not sure. We don't. I don't know what costs go into this stuff. But anyway, it's a super cool looking set. I hope you think the same. If not, let me know in the comments. Let me know your reasons. But let me know in the comments what you think of this one anyway. And so there you go, gang. A relatively short video. It was just a quick catch up on this one that um, I'd, uh, you know, I'd seen the images and caught up on today. There was some other stuff that was uh, released during the course of me being away, but I think it came. Those images were released so long ago, it would just be silly for me to try and catch up on. But there was a couple of really cool Christmas sets that I see that are coming out. The brand new um, old school Batmobile that's coming out. There are some really, really cool stuff. But I would imagine in the coming weeks, we are gonna see plenty of stuff, um, you know, making its way into the airwaves on the internet and all that because uh, all the October releases are just around the corner. And I know for a fact, there's gonna be some pretty cool stuff coming out in October and then on the run up to Christmas. But we're done for today. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and you've enjoyed this video. Drop a like on it, best way to support the channel. But until next time, I say what I always say, stay building good people. See you all later.